Hi, it's Joe. Welcome to the Quilt Report. Well, what I'm doing today is not anything that I've done before, actually. Oh, maybe once a long time ago. But uh, uh, what I'm doing is I'm uh, attaching my quilt to a frame. It's something I'm not usually in favor of. But as you can see with my messy, messy uh, work table here, uh, I uh, built the frame the other day by attaching some uh, steel mending plates to the corners of four boards. And then I attached an apron, I think is what you call it, to my quilt that's the single layer of extra fabric that i'm pulling around to the back uh, i'm pulling the apron around and then um uh, and i'm um stapling it to the back of the frame it's got a french cleat uh built in so once i install the bottom part on the wall, this will be the wall side, the quilt itself will be able to just drop right in. Just a beveled edge board with the matching bevel on the frame here. So that's what I'm doing. Um, I uh, made this uh, quilt for a friend of mine that owns a restaurant and she wanted a quilt of mine in, in her restaurant that I go to, it's a breakfast and lunch place called Canteen here in San Francisco. I go there often, take my students there when I have students in town. So now my big challenge is getting this even all the way along and as tight as I can pull it. The reason I'm doing this uh, is not only for ease of installation, uh, it's largely that, ease of installation, but also uh, um, it's going to be in a restaurant. I don't want it to be too welcoming. I don't, if it's loose, people will want to handle it, I'm afraid. And so uh, I'm interested in it looking more like a work of art that you shouldn't touch, you know? Uh, so I'm pulling this really as tight as I can. Uh, so it's primarily ease of installation, but secondarily, uh, I didn't quilt the background down. I wanted these people to just be able to exist there all over it, each one in his or her own space. Oops. Just like people on the sidewalk. And, um... Uh, I didn't quilt the background down. I didn't want to integrate them all together. And so uh, the, it's kind of poochy looking for me in between the people. Uh, I can finish it up here in a minute and show you. So here's the final quilt, about 56 by 59. And it has people all over it different people, groups of people that I found on the street. My wife. Oh, friends, strangers, students. People that you would find in a restaurant or on the street out in front of the restaurant. There you go. Next time you see this, it'll be up on a wall. Ha! Thanks for stopping by.